the purpose of an air maintenance device is one, to fill a system, a dry system with air, and also to maintain that pressure. So as we look at this, there's a number of components. You have got a large three quarter ball valve here. You've got a small quarter inch valve here, a small quarter inch valve here. In here, you have a check valve, and we also have a regulator with a restricted orifice. So the three quarter valve is used to fast fill a system. If I was to fill a system th through these quarter inch valves, it would take a long period of time. Dry system should be able to be able to fill the system within 30 minutes, and you utilize that by using your three quarter inch ball valve and filling it with your fast fill valve. Once you're within five pounds of pressure that's required for your dry system, you close your fast fill valve and then you open up your quarter inch valves that come through here and your regulator will be set to manufacture specifications. Right here is a restricted orifice that only allows a small amount of air to come into the system. Therefore, as you're losing air through a sprinkler head, you are not replenishing it at the same rate, thus allowing the sprinkler valve to trip. What we have here is a air compressor, also referred to as a riser mount compressor because it has no tank. So every time the system is in need of air, the pressure switch will kick on and will pump air into the system. Once it reaches the desired pressure, it will kick off. Here we have an air compressor that is used to supply air into a dry type sprinkler system, which also may be a pre-action system. This component here is actually tank mounted and it gives you a tank to actually allow for additional storage of air for the system. 